Hi there, gang. I wanted to see if maybe I could help you guys uh, that may be struggling to find out where to find this, these files that I am uh, sending to you in file sharing. But if you are on your home page of the OLS, you'll notice up here, right up in the top, you have a place called file sharing, a link called file sharing. Well, if you click on that file, click on that link, it will bring you to a page here, which shows you that you have files that are shared with you, I have shared with me, and then up here I have my files. Okay, so under the ones, uh, for example, under fifth assignments over here, now yours won't look like this unless you have created a folder that says fifth assignments, but under fifth assignments, assignment you'll see some documents some files that I have shared with you the top one here is the vocabulary for this first unit that we are in properties of matter and then here is velcro questions these are the questions the open response questions that accompany the book in the big universe library that you should read called burrs to velcro if you click on this document ask whether you want to open it or save it. If you open it, it's going to open up a Microsoft Word document. Now, there's a place for, it tells you that it goes with Lesson 10-7. It gives you a place for your name, and then there are three questions in here. Now, if you go up to this top, where this little yellow button is, uh, you'll see over here on the right, it says enable editing. And you'll have to click on that enable editing, but then that will allow you to type your name in there, type any answers to these questions that you want. All right? If I type, do that, then I can type in here my name, Mr. McIntosh. Now you may have to get rid of like these lines. Oops. And then I could type in my answer. What do I think is cool about Velcro? It's super easy. All right. And then I would just save this document with a name, right? Like Velcro questions. And I could just go to the end of that and go underscore Mr. McIntosh. Oops. And then once I've saved that, and I remember where I save it, I'm going to have to save it into a folder somewhere on this PC probably, and then you would have something that you can attach and send to me and in the email. So hopefully this is going to help you to understand how file sharing works. Once again, you'll see the link for it up at the top of your home page. You can click in there. That will bring you to the different files that I have shared with you and that you can use for any given assignment. I hope this is helpful, and if you have any further questions, please let me know.